And I think we look at, at least on the technical innovation, is part of a three-legged stool, the other two being people and process. Uh, we feel very much that technology itself can be an enabler. I think as we're moving from traditional ways of doing technology to newer ways to do proactive as opposed to reactive care, I think L uh, IT can it in fact actually be the strategy, not just an enabler. I mean, so right now for, for physicians, for healthcare system, it's a complex time. Um, we've got a softening market in terms of payment reimbursement. Uh, we've got obviously governmental shifts. And so very much we're trying to live in a value-based world that is the best quality for the lowest cost, but yet our payment and our incentive models are still very much in the volume-based world. So how do you actually pivot and also keep your doors open and provide excellent care? And so, you know, we're committed to that North Star, but it just takes time to get there. I'm a physician, not a developer, um, but I do have an appreciation for the complexity to actually go from concept, ideation, idea into something that is tangible and real. And so to me, it's not so much getting there, it's how you get there. How do you get there better, faster, cheaper? And so, you know, what an API affords is bright minds, developers to do rapid, iterative prototyping without the legacy um, uh, luggage, so to speak, that you tr traditionally encumbers uh, life cycle development, uh, especially in healthcare. The great thing about healthcare is we have a very, very clear North Star. At the Cleveland Clinic, it's the patient first. And so that is something that is uh, unequivocal, our, our challenge. We also have a fiduciary responsibility. We need to provide the best care for the lowest cost. And so technology, again, is one aspect of that, along with process redesign, care redesign, new ways to harness and collaborate with different sectors in, uh, in, the, in the nation. Technology can be done to you or with you. And it really, really needs to be done with you. That's why at the clinic, we actually have developers in the hospital. They see the impact of their work. It motivates, it aligns, and incentivizes them. I think it's important to focus. Um, right now, this is a brave new world around technology, and it's really, really easy to suffer from shiny object syndrome, where you constantly look at the next greatest thing. I think you need to be focused, and I think you need to be methodical. Design-based thinking actually affords you a methodology to achieve that. But if I'd say one word, it's focus.